Hi, this is Ron Martinson of ronmartblog.com and I'm going to show you today how to install the Nick Collection by Google that a lot of you are having to do today. So, like most of you, I found out about this at 8.24 a.m. in the morning and um, I'm just now getting around to trying it out. So, I have a Windows system, so I click on the link here and that launches my default browser which is Google Chrome because that's what a majority of my blog readers are using so I want to make sure I'm seeing the same thing you guys see and when I come after it finishes downloading there's an executable so I go ahead and run this and wait a minute this is Windows we can get prompt and a lot of you will get this uh, dialog here that says please close bridge so what you do is you come over here to task manager you right click say start task manager you can sort by image name under the processes tab locate bridge and you can either uh, come in here and say in process or click in process in here to forcefully kill it after we have bridge close hit retry and that should get you going again. You'll say OK. And then we'll go through our setup. I like to keep my Nick software on my F drive because that's my SSD, so I'll keep all of them there for performance reasons. Click Next. These are the products that I have currently on my system, and so it's going to install these add ins for all of them. And when it's complete, I say finish. And now if I go over to Photoshop. And so when Photoshop starts up here, I'll open up a, a file. And this is my assistant from a recent shoot. Uh, I'll come over here and say Nick Collection. And I can launch my plugins as usual. And so I can apply some effect or do anything that I normally do. And you'll see that it says Nick Collection, but for the most part, everything else is just like it's always been. Apply my image. I can come in and choose Nick Collection, Silver FX. Apply a Silver FX layer and do everything just as I did before. I still have my um, palette over here but now it says Google instead of Nick software and Nick collection by Google and again I can run anything that I want to do. Um, so I can run Viveza just like I did before and just really branding changes are all that's happened. So go to Lightroom. And if we right click on image, you can see that our plugins are there. So let's try color effects. And we can say edit a copy or original or whatever we want to do. Create a new TIFF file. Come in here and use it as normal. Come in here, do a little foliage, brighten up the colors, whatever we want to do. Hit save. And voila. Everything just works.